What is up killers, Kev here and today I'm back with a new video series. I do do the intro for this particular video once the footage comes on screen. To start to apologize really, the footage is really crisp and beautiful. The audio is incredibly off. I sound like a robot and uh, the music levels within the game are absolutely dire. I should have checked it before rolling or even videoing any of this but I just wanted to get your opinion on the editing style you're gonna see it probably about six minutes in the editing style some of it's gonna be sped up and so on and so forth we do a whole entire house within this video again just want to see your thoughts and opinions of the editing all the audio will be changed going forward into these videos I really do like this game and I want to be covering more of it and I want to see, see that progression and I want to do every single house this game has to offer so yeah audio will be changed let me know what you think of the commentary and mainly the editing but audio levels and so on and so forth will be rectified next video thanks guys for watching i really do appreciate it bear with me as this is kind of out of my comfort zone as usually my videos are going to be structured and a completely different game but let's jump straight into the video what is up killers kev here and today we are back with a new video kind of series to be hitting the channel this one is going to be house flipper loads of people have been playing this i've been playing it for probably about eight hours now so we've got the general gist as you can tell with the account balance we're up to just well over 120,000 pounds so what I want to do is do a beautiful house up for you guys but I'm going to do it so the editing is pretty much going to be sped up so we're not doing each and every individual room one at a time because that would take absolutely ages loads of different jobs obviously you guys know how it should work by now if you don't loads of other different introduction videos there I'm just gonna get right into it I'm not gonna mess about we're gonna grab a house and we are pretty much gonna do it up now I'm not too sure what to go for here because I kind of want to go for something like this and do it up simplistically on the fact of um, hopefully a little bit more margin in there I'm not too sure I'm not gonna bother doing the smaller houses and stuff like that we might go back to them in the future or might do them one at a time I'm not too sure because I've sold two already very nice flips on these ones uh, this one obviously was the better flip uh, don't know why but just was the better flip I absolutely foobarred this one and uh, it made more money than this one but each their own own obviously the first office I'm not too sure if this generates more 24 but we're gonna go for it anyway so I'm probably gonna just jump straight into it and uh, probably get something that fits the criteria of one of the ones that everyone wants. We won't go for one of these big ones just yet. I think we're going to play it a little bit safe and maybe go for... That's a bunker. I think we're going to go for... I'm interested in that one just because it's very weird. Let's go for this one right here. Let's have a quick look. Quite standard. A few other different bedrooms. Not a lot of pictures on that one, but let's buy it. And uh, let's get straight to work. So yeah, the editing on this is going to be a little bit sped up. That's going to obviously look a lot more sort of nicer. And uh, yeah, it's just gonna, we're going to get it done pretty quick, which is going to be good. And hopefully we're going to do a house an episode. And uh, yeah, a lot of people just find this very therapeutic. I do to play and uh, so on and so forth. Won't be doing the garden, but uh, obviously if you guys want to see a garden renovation, then obviously let me know. But yeah. So as you can tell in the left hand corner, this is uh, pretty much what people expect from the house itself. So we're going to need to paint the outside because this is horrible. I'm not too sure if it actually counts for the inside because this is what everyone is basically wanting to buy, as you can tell. Garden competition, green, and in the middle, blue. So yeah, let's clear up all of this stuff. And uh, yeah, we'll clear up the whole house. Is what I like doing is gutting the whole lot. And then um, yeah, we'll come to terms of what we're actually uh, dealing with. Okay, so there we go. We've pretty much uh, gutted the whole entire place. And now what I like to do is uh, pretty much survey the area. So obviously these walls need to be repaired. Uh, generally the whole place needs to be cleaned, which we will be doing in a bit. But the repairing is probably the main thing before cleaning and obviously before painting. Uh, we're going to buy one of those. And uh, yeah, and then we're going to... Uh, we're going to get a little bit of this and actually start fixing the walls. OK, 
Okay, so all the plastering is done, and now what we're going to do is go in and uh, pretty much clean this whole entire place from top to bottom. Gotta be careful, there's a few different, like, uh, sort of moldy patches or drip stains scattered around and so on and so forth. But uh, yeah, we're going to uh, clean the whole thing, and uh, once we've cleaned it all, then we can uh, pretty much crack on and think about what we actually want to do with this home. Now the place is completely cleaned and everything is replastered. What we can now establish is what is going where and so on and so forth. So this will obviously be the sort of kitchen and dining area. This will be the bedroom, which is quite large. So hopefully get a bed in here, maybe a desk, some uh, bookshelves and so on and so forth. Uh, the toilet, I'm going to be completely re-guttering and um, maybe move the fixtures around, fitting it all, changing the tar and the colour scheme completely. Uh, maybe putting some blinds and stuff across the window, make it look nice. This lighting's got to be cosy, and I'm really not too sure what I'm going to be doing down in this particular area. I might knock this through so we can get a walkthrough just in general to make it slightly bigger, or we could go million pound mansion and um, pretty much make a swimming pool, which would be pretty cool if that is a feature within this game. But uh, yeah, so what I'm going to start doing now is um, I kind of want to start making this into our area of luxury. As soon as we come through the door it needs to be kind of homey so what we need to do is look up some light systems to see if um, we can actually make it looks quite nice. So there's lamps, ceiling lamps. I always go for these chandeliers and bulbs just because they're really nice and uh, we're going to go for a sort of white and a brown system here. This is what I usually would go for as well with uh, the majority of my builds in this particular game turn those on and there's no fuse in here at all which was a little bit of a guess just because um, I think I've done this house in a mission I'm not too sure so uh, yeah we're gonna go down there and uh, fix a fuse let's go down there now and have a little look let's open assemble I'm gonna take the old one out put the new one in we are going to flip the switch up and then it should be a-okay which we can double check yep and it works as you can tell good natural lighting in here which is great um, I'm obviously going to, before I start hanging blinds and curtains throughout the house, uh, we're going to need to do the walls. So I'm going to change the floor tiles just in general, because I don't like those at all. We need to be a little bit more lighter for this area. So we're going to do uh, floors, and we're going to do floor, not floor tiles, floor panels. And uh, we're going to go a little bit lighter here, just because uh, at the moment this is quite dark. But I do think it is almost the same. Yes, yeah, so we need to go one more lighter. I think probably that might be too light, but I'm going to try anyway. I think we should be okay. Let's go there. Yep, ah, that, that'd be alright. That's going to be a lot more lighter than that, but that's fine. Get the other half done. Let's do there. Middle bit and the last bit is the pre-processed doors, and that is pretty much it. Cool. We're going to keep these here. Don't, not too sure if you can actually change them. I'm personally am not a massive fan of them, but uh, you know it's quite nice to walk out onto and so on and so forth. Outside of the house isn't too bad either, so we might leave that as as said before. It's more kind of a case of interest of the inside. I'm not even too sure. Can we just clean this off? Oh, we can. Let's take that off like so. house. Brilliant. Okay, cool. So the lights work. That's naturally and that's fine. Uh, the fire alarm is in here as well because we're going to have a kitchen. So uh, let's think about making a kitchen right now. I'm going to go for a corner piece maybe in here. So let's go back. Kitchen. And we want to go for a rounded kitchen appliance. Maybe something royal like this. This looks nice. Uh, maybe with the dark and the dark tops. 
because you don't want to go for something too light. It's quite nice. I'm going to go for that. Throw that around there. And the awkward thing is, is the windows, but I'm not sure if we can get rid of those. No. Hmm. Okay, you can't... You can't even smash them out. It's a little bit strange, but I'll... Okay, so we want to go for that because it's too large. Maybe for a smaller one. Something like uh, this. This would be good. Again, lighter on this one. Uh, silver, light, and is that black or white? Let's go for white. I think we're going to put that there like so. Very nice indeed. Cool, cool. Right, fridge and a cooker is essential. So let's go cooker. Um... I kind of want the one that just goes on the surface, just because I feel that's going to be a little bit easier. Tend to detailing as well, which, which is what I'm going for. I do like adding a lot of detail, even though the uh, furnitures really don't matter that much within um, sort of buying and reselling, but I do like them. Uh, top cupboards won't be doing that in this one. Um, again, need appliances. I think pretty sure they're in here. These things are great as well, we're going to be adding those as well, just scattered around. Um, teapot, you got to get a teapot. Uh, that will be moved, but it's always good just to have it at the same time. I like doing that as well, if I get just random things, uh, for instance like a welcome mat. And, uh, yeah, just put them down as I see fit. I think by adding decorations and so on and so forth and making it a little bit more cosier, I think you actually do get more money. I'm not too sure. I'm going to grab soap again with the lighter one. Twist that. Tend to deal with detail and uh, detailing, as I said before, is uh, it's definitely going to be a massive thing for me. So we're going to be doing that awful lot. It's a pretty cool clock. Not sure what's happened with the colours there, but that's fine. Uh, why, mm, we can add that because it isn't going to obstruct too much due to the fact of um, everything else. I want to know if that can go. That can't go there because it's too large. This is awkward, this room, because purely on the simplistic fact of that it is, this is kind of in the way. Can we sell this? We can. Sick. I'm going to put some walls in this a little bit quicker. Because uh, yeah, this this uh, this get a little bit awkward. Let's uh, let's speed this up a little bit. Okay, so what I've actually done is sealed off this wall completely, just for the simplistic fact of uh, we haven't got enough room in here to get a lounge and a kitchen, so I've kind of done that. If we go on the outside, it looks really, really weird, like this. Um, I am actually going to rectify this. I'm going to put something in there, maybe some, pla uh, some plant pots, shall I say, uh, maybe spice it up and jazz it up a little bit some wooden tiles on the outside something like that if we don't do that that's fine just because it kind of doesn't count in this game it only counts when you're inside so they're only going to sort of worry about the inside aspect of it yeah it's, it's, it's very strange but we are <laughs> we are going to crack on it with that just generally and um, because i wanted a sofa here and a tv around here and uh, just it's just a little bit easier i don't know why you can't knock through the building um, for the wooden slats and everything else. Uh, it's very strange, you can't even fill it up. So I've just made a sort of a breach wall between the two there just to conceal it and uh, cover it up. So we're gonna crack on. And uh, I've got a skill point, which is great. Uh, let's go for 400% faster building on that one, which is awesome. So haven't thought of the sort of system to do with uh, what we're actually going to be sort of painting this in. I'm not entirely too sure yet. I might have a feature wall and then probably um, something else on the long lines of uh, the rest being just a standard color, which I'm probably going to be doing just because it's, uh, it's a little bit more easier. So let's go for shoe cupboard. 
How big is this one? Wouldn't mind that near the door. That is awesome. We can have that. Let's go right there. And then we can come back here as again. Loving the detail. Fireplace probably not going to be viable with um, kind of what we're going for here. As this uh, it is quite small. I've paid less for bigger houses, which is a little bit strange in my eyes, but that is fine. Fridges, these are only the tiny ones, which is annoying. Uh, appliances, home appliances, which comes under fridges and whatnot. Oh, not sure about that. Might clash. Stainless steel one. Can that go right near the window? I'm not sure if that's going to be viable though. Can't go in the corner, that'd be silly. Hmm. Um, maybe where the bin is could work. Let's just have a look, quick little look to see what it actually looks like. Okay, I'm gonna go for the bin is, and then the cooker is gonna go around this side. Gonna put that there. Move that a little bit closer is being blocked by something, which I think is this. No. Why is that being... Oh, we had it. Come on. Maybe you can't push it right up to the wall. Oh, okay, there we go. No, that is flush. Brilliant. I'm going to close that and we're going to get some blinds fit just because we're going to get it all done. No, we're not. Just because I've literally thought of it. Won't be doing that because we are going to need to decorate it very shortly. Let's put the kettle in the corner. I want to move this one, one over. And then uh, let's get some decoration in here as well, which is going to be in the kitchen. No, it's going to be others, and I want these ones. Kitchen utensils is going to be right there, and I want the longer one. Do I want it in that colour? No. It's <laughs> a simplistic fact. I don't want it in that colour. Let's go back, kitchen. Notice in under others, that one. Let's go for that lighter. Yes, that's nice. That is clean. Move the clock over there. Back. The longer one, again in white. All white, it's nice. Now, I kind of got to get this somewhere. Right, we're going to have a quick move around. Let's go a little bit higher with that one, and this one is going to go there. Cool. Right, so that box out that wall, which is great. Let's move the clock over ever so slightly. Let's get a couple of decoration of plants in here. Burn with a white pot up on the windowsill, because why not? And then we're going to go for a slightly larger one on the floor here, right next to the shoe rack, because again, looks nice. Let's get a sofa in here. Sofa. Not sure which one to go for, probably a smaller one. Maybe these, can we change the colour? Ooh, none of those colours. Stripes. Ooh, yeah. That's nice. Let's go. How far away can we have it? Probably there we'll get away with. Uh, we'll TV. Cabinet stand. Let's go for a Royal one, a classic. I mean, that is massive, but... Gonna go for a thinner one and a coffee table. I thought of it. Oh, didn't realize we can get a corner one. Am I gonna like the corner one? Let's have a look. Actually, probably might be able to gauge more space out of this. Is that weird? I kind of like that though. Avoid the coffee top, uh, coffee top, coffee table. No, I don't know. I don't really, I'm not sure if I like that. Or, I 
do like this though. Now we can have a coffee table. So we can sell that, we can go back in here. We can get a hanging TV up on this wall, which is cool. We'll go for a small cabinet maybe. I really want a thin one. How thin is this one? No. I'm gonna go for a coffee table. Let's go back in here. Is there no furniture. Yep, we wanna go tables. And I like I've always liked the glass one. It's always a go-to, it's always quite nice. Is that pink? Jeez. Don't want that. Uh, again, let's go back to this one. This is nice, cool. Go back in here, we want to go to others. Grab the TV remote too, it's got a base up on here. I'm sure I should get an actual plant. Knives, we can buy those, they'll be great up here. So. I think there's a chopping board to go with it as well. Yep. Like so, uh, over for recipes that can go in the back corner because no one actually puts it in the foreground. I don't really want it on the floor. There we go. Cool. TV remote. A couple candles. Oh man, let's get, let's get a few going on there. Random knife, don't particularly want that, it's a little bit scary. Coffee cup. Just because aesthetic, I don't know, looks kind of cool. Is this a big mirror? I wouldn't have minded a big mirror. Now, a massive mirror would be great, it says £12.40. That's 15. Is that a monster one? Oh, with the white frames. That's cool. Let's go there with it. It'll look nicer once the uh, walls sort of uh, convey it up. That'll look cool. A couple plates. No, not really. What? Where is the TV remote? There it is. Cool. I think that looks really cool. Convenient though, you've got to think about it, there's not a lot of room to be working within this small section. Under. No, we want to get decoration. Maybe get some paintings here, a bigger plant in the back area here. So as we could squeeze in here if we can, let's put that there for the time being. Can we squeeze one of these in there? This is a big boy. That's all we can. A flush against the wall. It is. Cool. Plant. We can put in, hopefully, the corner. Didn't really want it up there, but alright. Again, don't want it in the middle of nowhere. Um, this is awkward. I think this is going to be too large. Let's sell that one. Go back into other. Again, nope. Don't want any of that. Decoration. Maybe this one? This might work. Everything. Can we get one up there? No, we can't. Just want one slightly smaller. That's got to be a perfect fit. It has. Sick. Cool. Right. I'm pretty happy with that. Paint for me and my husband. Hang on, girl. We're going to paint it. Right now, let's get down to the painting. I 
feel like maybe a grey and a white for this room. Again, feature wall. And one... Yeah, one feature wall, so let's go for a silver. Uh, we're going to buy one, and then we're going to get to the white. Right, let's paint these walls and get a feature wall going. Okay guys, so there we go, we've pretty much done the uh, the living room here, maybe going to add a painting or two, probably going to get rid of this mirror to be totally honest, maybe a painting there and add the blinds, so let's purchase those right now, and uh, we'll get on with those, so obviously the paintings, we're going to be decoration, and pictures and paintings, not plants, uh, hopefully this is a big one, it is, good, that's good, put that there, and then we're going to get some blinds in here, not curtains, because, uh, gonna go for let's go for closed we're gonna get two of those maybe 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 open are they bigger no they're not mm. okay let's get closed too closed too closed let's go for one there and we're gonna go for one there and now what we're gonna do is assemble both Okay, so there we go. The kitchen and the lounge have been done. Walk in, put your shoes up, hang your coat up, get the TV on, and while you're doing that, you can make yourself a lovely meal. So, the hall is done and everything else. Might add something here, but I'm not too sure what just yet. And uh, I'm probably gonna add another chandelier light in the hall, because it is desolate at the moment. So let's add one of those now, which is gonna be a ceiling lamp chandelier. Let's crack on with the bedroom. These doors are okay. I'm, I'm not going to replace them. They are in good condition. Uh, some of the stuff, probably thinking, Kev, the majority of the stuff of this house was in good condition. Only need to slightly change it, but meh, we, we, we don't kind of roll like that. That's fine. A radiator in here would be pretty decent. I might add one onto this wall before we go anywhere else, just to get a little bit of heat into the room. As there is... No, um, that is a large facility right there. Oh, that is kind of large. Can't even get it under there. Get one in the hall. Let's assemble it real quick. So we've got a radiator in here, that'll do I think. Um, again, not too sure what to do in here, I'm probably just going to flesh it out with a little bit of paintings. Uh, the buyers can pretty much do what they want with it. Entirely up to them. I'm just going to leave it like that. I think that's pretty decent, it's pretty clean, again they can add what they want. But, let's crack on with the, um, let's crack on with the bedroom, which I'm feeling carpet in this room. So good floors, and we're gonna go coverage. Let's go for just for this boring carpet. Nothing, uh, nothing too exciting. A little bit of dirt on the floor, which we will scoop up. Carpet uh, sounds like tiles, which is a little bit worrying, but that is a uh, it's fine. Cool, right. Let's get a light in here because uh, we cannot see what we're doing. Let's get 
back into lamps, ceiling lights. I'm not too sure what to go in here. These are pretty duty. I do enjoy these. Kind of reminds me of something what I got in my room. So we're gonna put one there, and then we are gonna put one. I want to say facing that way. Just because it's pretty cool. Where's the light switch? Let's have a little look. Oh yeah, that's kind of cool, isn't it? Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Thinking about it now. Hmm. We're gonna keep it like that. It's kind of gloomy. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cozy at the same time. It's weird. We've got to get rad on that wall. So we're just gonna throw that on there for the time being. Again, I'm probably gonna go for white in this room. But again, I want a feature wall. So feeling. White panels. What are these? Oh, mm, I'm not too sure about those ones. Outside panels. That's cool to see that there is those. Might rechange the whole room actually. Bright panels. Let's have a quick look what these look like. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have a feature wall. Definitely. Never done this before. So we're gonna, we're gonna see what it looks like. Cool. And there is our feature wall. I think we'll leave just the one wall like that. Uh, the bed is going up this end. I'm torn between to do the whole room, but uh, now nah, I'm probably just gonna do one feature wall. Let's go back to the white paint here. Let's get a couple of those. Let's buy many. Uh, I think two gallons would be enough. Two liters. Two liters, you'll be lucky. Uh, that's more than two liters. But yeah, we're going to speed run and uh, get this whole room looking white. The reason why I do white walls is just the simplistic fact of if I was going to buy a house and I saw white, I'd think possibilities to do other things and uh, change up the color. Color here and there is all right, but uh, mutual color is always good for, uh, for someone who's buying a house. So yeah, let's, uh, let's get the rest of the uh, bedroom done. Okay, so the room is completely done in white now, which is uh, kind of nice, I like it. Let's assemble the radiator. This is a really quick fit in again, because I've got those uh, perk points pretty much almost maxed. Not in everything, but in certain things. So the radiator is done. We're gonna get some curtains in here. And uh, I'm not sure what to go for in curtain-wise. I'll probably wanna go for long, and uh, we're gonna go for, we're gonna go for these ones. These are nice, I like these. For that one, I'm gonna buy another one and we're gonna pick those there. That's cool. Let's grab a bed in before we start thinking about assembling those. Not bunk beds, big old bed. Let's go for a big royal bed. Double heart, that's nice. Um oof. not liking the uh the bedding. Alright, let's bail on that one. <laughs> um That's pretty clean, I like that. I don't want too much colour. I think an all white, that will look nice. Yeah, an all white bed. Pop that close to the wall. Nice. Uh, let's get some bedside cabinets. Bedside tables, again. One there. And one on this side. Is it facing the right way? It is, cool. And one on that side. Nice. Let's go for clock. Well, these are nice. Paving stones. Didn't even think that was a thing within the game. Did I put clock? There we go. Alarm clock. Uh, white one. I like that there. And then we're going to go into decorations. This one. Where's it go to? Nice. And again, something that complements the room. This one's nice. I can't put that on the wall. 
There we go. Right, let's assemble these. Again, super easy, super fast, because it's just a bracket with some screws, and then for some strange reason, you literally just throw the curtains up, which I am all for. Back on the wall, a couple screws, like so. Curtains up, boom, done. Nice, it's looking good in it, it's looking good. Right. I think I kind of want to put something here, either a computer or something along the lines of that. Let's go desk. Is there a corn desk? Computer desk. Ah, there is. Slight corner one. I feel like that's going to be massive though. It's not too bad actually. Hmm. Oh. Didn't even realise. Thank you, carpet. Correct in hat. Um, actually, I tell you what I'm going to do. Just thought of it. I'm going to go for that one. Go for grey. Go here. I'm going to speed this so quick. It's going to be so good. Monitor. That is a huge monitor. Um, maybe not the best desk. Let's switch it up actually. Let's go for that. White. How big is that? That's going to fit there. Yeah, that will fit there. Like so. Best lamp. Mouse, actual PC, which we put in there. Keyboard, oh, was that monitor HD? Sick, that's a big boy as well. Jeez. Bring this forward a little bit. That's a huge, that is a rather huge monitor. Kind of feels like that's an actual, yeah, an actual monitor than a uh, computer one office chair. Again, in that crispy white. Let's put a slight angle because it looks cool. Bookshelves in that one, which I thought of. Which is These ones are nice. That. Correction. I like these, so I'm going to get another one. One kit. Uh, there. Bim. Office one, because why not? This room's pretty much done, like I said. What other electrical appliances? Is anything fun in here? DVD? Nah. Coffee machine? Not sure I'd want that. I'm presuming this is going to be like almost a uh, speaker system. Should be kind of cool. Let's put one of those there like that. I think that's. Pretty much it. I want to get a rug, maybe. Just touch up a little bit. Floor, rug. Goes well with white. Not a grey rug, it's a bit boring. So let's set it off. Let's set it off. Is that, is that too much? Nope. That's very nice. Cool. I'm happy with that room. So that's the bedroom done. Back into the hall in the kitchen. 
bit more different of mood lighting in there. Okay, now the bathroom. Hmm. Let's crack with the bathroom. So blind, we want one of those. I want closed blind, obviously. Two brackets again. The screws, lines up. Yep. Uh, rad I'm going to do after the tiling, so I'm going to think of a really nice tiling system, but before we jump in that, I'm going to do the lights, ceiling lights, and we are going to go for halogen lamp, because I like halogens, they are very nice, and they are extremely bright. So, and then I think probably a couple in between, that is probably really off. Nope, that is good. Right, so let's do some tiling. Walls, wall tiles, and we are going to go for these bad boys. Three stacks of those, and let's get tiling. So there we go, we have done all the fixtures, as you can tell it looks really, really nice in here. Again, this wall's looking a little bit desperate, I'd like that lower, but that's fine, that is all good by me, that is all gravy. I do like these bath lamps, I think they're absolutely gorgeous, uh, it just kind of illuminates the bath a little bit more, a little bit more of the focus point of that, which is great. I'm going to go others here, maybe throw a little bit of a, some more, um, a little bit more volume to the, um, so the actual, well, yeah, the the bathroom itself. Why can't we put towels in the sink? That is awkward. Put them on the floor. Which, uh, kind of want to don't be doing. I don't really want to be putting them on the windowsill. Okay, that is completely out of the equation on that one. Teddy bears, no hangers, no whiteboards, no. But that is cool to remember in the future. Let's get a vase up there just because it looks pretty cool. Let's grab that there empty one. Again, a little bit awkward, but that's fine. Uh, clock, no. Laundry basket. Didn't think of that. That is a cool thing to uh, hang in here, though. Right underneath the towel rack. It's easier for everyone then, isn't it? There we go. Uh, candles. Everyone loves candles. Let's get a few of those in there. Can we put them on the bar? Nah, that's a shame. Get them up on the windowsill, then. And let's get a smaller one as well while we're here. Again, Nice detailing, got to put it in there. Scroll out anything else worthy. Toothbrush, can we put that on the sink? No, you cannot. 
Very strange how you can't put these things where you think you could put them. Shampoo. You can't put it either. I've got an idea. I have got an idea. I'm gonna go with that one. Go white. Another one and plonk it. Right. The With the light, I'm gonna go white. Put that right there. Turn that on too. I'm gonna go back to others. Scroll all the way back down. I'm gonna get some shampoos and other different fancy things on this. Grab a soap. Again, can't even put the soap near the sink. But that's all good. Shampoos. Can we put those on top? Yeah, we can. Cool. Let's put a couple of those up there. Buy many. Or we can buy different colours, actually. That'd make it a little bit more... Uh, feel that they are different things, when really they aren't. They're exactly the same thing. I like these. I'm going to put them on the... Up on the window. I'm just going to go here. Big fan of these. I think they're really cool. Offsets are run great as well. Mugs, no. Uh, Falling, no, we don't want one of those in here. Stack of towels. Can I put these here, please? You want me to place them on the floor? Maybe up here. I mean, they're kind of overhanging, but that will do. That is going to be my bathroom for this house. Let's head on out. And uh, yeah, the, we're, we're pretty much getting there and almost done. I'm not going to be doing too much to this particular area. I'm going to add some lighting though because it is horrendous. Ceiling lights. Um, again, not too sure what to put in here. Maybe one of these just because it kind of fits the criteria of what this actually is. Um, I feel like I need a switch in here. Is this going to prompt that one? Nope. Okay, let's buy many. Let's get a few in here just because. There we go. Will this work? Yeah, cool. Nice. I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna put a switch here. This is gonna this is gonna trigger me otherwise. Let's get a switch. Uh, model light switch. That'll do. I'm gonna bung that right there. Oh, hello, hello. Gonna have, I'm not gonna have a light in that bit. <laughs> I think what I'm gonna do is probably, yeah, we're probably gonna add some shelves in here. To be honest, these big ones. Again, because buyers like them for some strange reason. I'm gonna have two layers. So, like that. Uh, we're gonna knock this through. Don't like this. We're literally gonna knock it straight through. So let's do that now. I think that's gonna be just right. Again, not too sure why this isn't connecting with my other lights. Will it work like that? It will. Cool. Um, this is going to be a fixture for what? A sink. Hmm. Will I have a washer? Can I get a washer in there? Don't think it's going to connect to that though. Washer pump. Let's get a few going. Let's get one. And, you know what? Let's get two. Just because... Uh, because I feel like it's going to look cool. Let's get rid of those. Uh, let's buy two of these. Or not, let's unscrew these first. Really? I already had one. Yep, near me. Let's get rid of that one. That one. And uh, let's go back into washers. I'm going to buy one. And let's buy two. Let's 
go back to walls and see plaster, no, wall tiles, tiling down here, what should we have it, hmm, paint, let's go white paint, white it up down here, buy many, I think three will be just enough, let's flip these and then we're going to paint the room. The washroom is all done, painted it all white, and it is looking pretty damn good down here. Again, it opens up options to people that what they want to do in here. It's entirely up to them. I am going to add a safe. I just thought it was a kind of a cool thing to add, just maybe down here, just because it looks pretty doody. Painted all the white up here. Fixtures won't go up there with everything else. But I think we're pretty much done in here. I think this is a very nice home, a very nice house. Um, I'm not too sure what it would sell for. But uh, let's go outside and have a little look, see what our profit is. I'm not going to change anything outside. Uh, they can do that. I'm going to get rid of the paint though, just because that's pretty horrendous. Let's have a quick walk around. It's looking really, it's looking really nice. This is. I'm not going to worry about this. I'm not going to worry about this. It's perfectly clean. Cool. Apparently, which I personally don't think it is. But yeah, let's sell the house. Put a house on auction. Let's see what we get. Put the house on auction. See what the bids will go up to here. So the house price cost is wasn't that too much. Renovation not too bad. Venture items four thousand. Profit of sixty two thousand, which is really really good. That is definitely a big sell, guys. If you did enjoy the sort of video as a whole, let me know. Uh, editing on this one's going to be a little bit different than it usually would be. Um, nice new series, very therapeutic, ideas will be mixed up, um, obviously we're going to get bigger and better houses and uh, see where we go on those particular ones, but guys, if you did enjoy, very much appreciate a like on the video, uh, subscribe if you're new, many more of these videos to be coming, and I'll see you in the next one.